Hello game fans! Turn On is a puzzle platformer from the team at Brady Studios. Turn On is their fourth game and it won the Imagine Cup 2014 held by Microsoft. The game first appeared on the Windows Phone and it was later greenlit on Steam. Now Turn On has arrived on Xbox One. And you know what? It's shockingly good. <laughs> If you're old enough to remember Gremlins 2, you'll recollect one gremlin that gets turned into pure electricity. This lightning gremlin zips around the wires in the clamp building before finally zapping all of the other gremlins later in the movie. In Turn On The Game, you play as a living ball of electricity, similar to that gremlin, who can zip along the power lines and jump from one to the other. Unlike the evil gremlin in the movie though, you seek to help the citizens of the city by bringing light and life back to a city plunged into darkness. Whilst the art style is cute, the music is soothing and the gameplay is simple, my favourite part of Turn On is helping the unknowing citizens with their mundane tasks. Whether you are turning on the TV for a disgruntled granny or scaring away looters by powering up the alarm, the joy of Turn On comes in helping people and bringing the city back to normality. The various stages range from escaping the power station to powering up the vast sky skyscrapers. And along the way you will light up the high street, get chased by trams and helicopters and even work your way through an amusement park. The whole game is devoid of speech and uses comic book style panels to move the story along, making it easily accessible for a younger audience. My biggest gripe however, is, and what the youngsters might actually struggle with, is that there are a handful of these track jumping levels in which the main character zips along one of four wires and must jump from wire to wire across this great expansive area whilst being chased. These levels are infuriating and can take many tries to complete, partly because of the difficulty but also due to some clunky controls and gravity issues. However, if you can work your way through the tougher levels, you unravel a sweet story with morals and a very good heart. It's well worth a play and it's on the indie marketplace right now. So if this review has been useful, then please leave a comment, subscribe and give it a thumbs up. It all goes to help the channel and I'll be back with another video very soon. Addiction is a strange thing. How you can consume your, your life and change your daily routine is quite amazing. Um, and I've been told I have an addictive personality, and I think it's probably do. Uh, and over the past couple of months, um, my fixation has been with Minecraft. Uh, like many people, I saw Minecraft and I just didn't get it. Uh, a game with...